Justin, it's a disappointing result in the end, but how pleased are you to see the performance tonight from your lads against a pretty strong grey side this evening? Yeah, and I'm happy because we was depleted today. We've got probably seven, eight players missing today, including people that are eligible and people that are injured. So, and there were a few 17-year-olds that played today. So, in terms of that, yeah, please, obviously disappointed that we lost the game because if we lost because they done something good, I would be happy, but we gave them two goals. Uh, but, yeah, there's a lot of positives come out of it. A few people, have, like Matty, I think, has come in and done, done himself justice. You know, he's given me a headache there. There's a few people that come in that maybe um, they're not ready. Uh, but we're down to bare bones today. I named two people on the bench today that they're not fit enough. You know, i just done it to, to have numbers on there because we're depleted and ineligible. But now we can get back onto the league and concentrate on what is our priority. I did want to get to a cup final, but priority is to go and run in the league and see where it takes us. Well, our boys we tried our hardest. We went into the game thinking that we could win. Come to the game strong, hard-headed. Everyone we had love for each other from the start of the game to the end. And Grays, they fought. They fought hard. I thought our boys, we tried hard. We pushed on. We looked to score goals. But Grays, I think they just dug deeper than us. In the end, our boys, I think our performance today played great. As a team, we just needed that end product that we was missing in the end. Yeah, we just got a. From this game, I think we just got to push on, got to push on, work harder. Just got to take this game on the head. We lost the game, but our performance wasn't terrible. We've got to take it to the next game and push on harder. We've got to show that we're hungry, hungry to win, hungry to go, go up into the league. We show that we're better than these boys that are better that are in the top of the league. We've got to show that in all our games, show up, show that to all the other teams, and show that we can get promoted as well this season. You took the lead pretty early on. Is it a bit of a Obviously, it's a disappointment to concede a goal, but you're disappointed in the fact you conceded it so quickly after you scored. Yeah, the, was it 30 seconds? It's about a minute or two. Minute, yeah. yeah, so disappointing, yeah, because maybe we were too happy and still celebrating, but you can't switch off in football. It takes a second to score a goal. But I'm pleased because there's a lot of youngsters out there, uh, and that's the positives I'm going to take out of that. One or two of them have proved to me they can play at this level, and one or two of them showed me they're not ready. There's a lot to work on. That, my massive criticism today is that I don't think we've got enough balls in the box and if we did I think we'd have and problems as you saw for the first goal. It's very disappointing. After the first goal I thought yes, we were buzzing, buzzing to go. I thought good start, started well to the game and then straight away they just scored a goal and I think that knocked some of our heads and then during the game as you can see that they went on and scored again and towards the end it just didn't look like, it looked like we couldn't score but it didn't look like we had enough hunger and desire to go for it which we need to take into the next game. You mentioned the performance of Matty Bakari, who works extremely hard in the middle. Were there any other sort of standout performances this season? Uh, I thought Jack was back to his best today. Pulled off some decent saves. Matty's probably took the limelight. Matty would have been my man in the match, yeah. Uh, Carl was probably quiet today. They probably that, He said to me at half time, they're, they're too, Mark, too, putting two defenders on him. They obviously know about him because he's on fire. And uh, like I said, we just need to concentrate get back on the league now and start to take our performance walk in the second half into the league. My performance today, I just all I wanted to do was work hard for the team. I ain't been playing much, but all I could do for the, today, today for the team was just work hard. Dig deep, work hard, do what the gaffer wants me to do. Get into areas, tackle, go forward, create something for the team. All I had to do today was work hard. That's all I needed to do. Is it a disappointment as well that after the Grays went down to 10 men, you weren't really able to test Johnson in the Grays goal? That's absolutely right. We should have capitalised on that and then getting sent off. And we didn't. Just look like you just pin, pin them in, and you just couldn't get the ball into back of the net in time. As you mentioned, there's plenty of positives to take from this game. You've got a game on Saturday now against uh, Burnham Rambers. Massive game, yeah. Massive game yeah. in the league. You're looking forward to that? Yeah, I'm looking forward to that because then, I can, like I said, there'll be four or five players that are available. That just makes us even stronger, as well as those that are here today. Uh, we've managed to sign uh, a new centre half this week, so uh, it, it will be strong Saturday, and I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, definitely. That's what we need to do. We just need recently the last couple of games we ain't really had much games going. We ain't played much league games. And this game is just a, it's basically a game to build into that league game for us to win. And Burn Wranglers is a perfect opportunity for us to get another three points in the league.